Mr. Chair. There were some great movies like Rob Roy. And uh, there were great titles. And in the sense of the great statements about the wind blows west and the darkened days arise and the grapes are wrath is what's happened here. We are seeing the drifting and the undoing of the working class's rights in this country. Mr Brownlee knows that. The member from Wairarapa just signalled that the key issue is it is either short term or long term. And that's the moot point. This is neither. This is putting people's security at risk. It is great that the Hobbit is here. It is great that the film has remained in this country. And you knew when the Prime Minister on the TV said, when he was asked, how's it going? And he said, oh, it's really touch and go. He's a great man. He's a great actor. He put the signal on. And you knew right then that he'd had the deal sewn up. Three days before it was, it was announced. Yes, he did. And Mr Brownlee knows that. A lot of us have watched movies, so you know who are good actors and who are slow actors. And Tiger Waititi made this great movie in this country. And I want to talk about Māori participation, like the whale rider. Because I heard a whole lot of huffing and puffing and rubbish from the Māori Party member on how this will help Māori people. This is a disgrace. In the sense of helping major corporates and movies like Boy had no support, isn't it amazing? But the minister sits there and is supposed to be the architect of modern rules and legislation in the sense of the title. what should create a good title for this bill, uh, Mr Chair. And it can be renamed and restated a whole lot of things. It could be pork pie, loony tunes and all of those great main titles. Bill, it could be well right of it, the bill, because this is about riding the workers and trying to use leverage to do what you have sneakingly been doing. Order, order. Right. Oh, not, Sorry. not, not the uh, uh, Some of those members over there have been trying to do, Mr. Chair. And I want to reiterate what my learned colleague said here earlier on. This is a subtle creep. No, it isn't, Mr. This is a subtle creep because they said that the 90-day bill was a trial period. And that's what this is, a trial period. Then all of a sudden, oops, slip, slash. Like Mickey Mouse, this has got to pervade over all the businesses. So we try to get around this by playing a f the favourite trick of the corporates and the people who want to control the working class. As we move people from full rights within the framework of employment rights to being contractors. Like in telecom and that. So what is the main nub of, of a movement like that? It is quite simply you move the costs and the pressures onto the individual. And that is real cost savings. And I heard Udaro Fravel, who I've got a lot of respect for, mutter and stutter and go on about Māori workers are behind by 25%. And he talked about the pay... Uh, the imbalance in relation to pay parity with nurses, Parker and Māori. Well, if you think that was great, and one member over there said that this would give 400 Māoris a job, that joke at the back there, the party jumper. Well, what about the other 169,000 who are losing hey, their... Point of order, uh, Chris Tremaine. Thank you, Mr Chair. I just want to bring you, uh, your attention to Clause 107 about relevancy. Mm -hmm. This clause is about the title of the bill. I haven't heard one mention of the title of the bill in the two or three minutes. Uh, uh, order. Uh, at all. And uh, I'd like you to um, bring it yeah. forward, please. Um, I, I just need to keep reading... Oh, come on, my feet. <laughs> I just uh, want to keep re-emphasising um, two points. That, that whilst this has not gone... Uh, to a select committee, and there is there is a a more tolerance of a, a slightly wider favour. It does not open this up to a general debate to, style of debate, and the member should make um, references to to the statements he's making and the analogies he's using it, the pertinence to the title, because this is clause one, the title clause. Honourable Paracour, Chair, I misunderstood the speaker earlier on, but I, I take the point. And, and certainly there could be a whole lot of adjustments in the banner, as, as Chris Tremaine has uh, pointed out. This is, could be the unrelated 
relationships between employers and workers built. Because that's what it is. This is it could be the relevant support of workers' rights bill. I know what the bill is about, Mr. Henry. It's about increasing the 169,000 people who are unemployed. This could be the increase the unemployed numbers bill. This could be that. It could be that. It could be that. It could be that. It could decrease. It could decrease. But then, like all those other issues relevant to this, the mighty international corporate swans off with support. No, 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 with support, uh, Mr. Henry. And it's really important. You're lucky.